you know, not interest, but you you lose your attention for just that moment, anything could happen. So if I'm not careful of what I do, I can lose my life, I can lose a limb, I can lose a finger, and it's not gonna be the same. Safety is a big issue. You know, I'm looking forward to the next chapter of my life and seeing my grandkids grow up. You know, just like everybody else, you wanna go home the way you came. So I, I kind of, even though most jobs already stress it, it's also up to the person to want to Nobody wants to get to the life-changing event that you lose a finger and then you learn your lesson. You don't want to be the story of why we wear gloves. You don't want to be the story of, oh, well, go look at that guy and let him tell you his scary story. Fingers are not just part of my hands. I mean, this, these are paintbrushes. Um, they're, you know, sandcastle builders. There's ball catchers. There's, you know, the, the gardening and my personal pleasures of of video games or you know we have musical instruments you know that we bang on I mean all those all those things are affected if I can't hold a tambourine or castanets or you know you can still paint it's not that you're you're not able to do these things it's just a lot harder but I'm you know married uh, and I have no kids but I still have my dog I still want to go home and you know do activities with them. So I want to go home the same way I went into work. I have four kids. If I can't go home and run around and play with them like they want me to every single day, I think uh, both of our lives would be changed differently. That's one of the biggest parts of safety in the job is making sure you can continue to do the job and provide for family or yourself if you don't have family. Fingers are life, really, to me. We eat with them, we play with them, we do our hobbies with them, and you take any one of those fingers out, the hand is no longer the same and things have to be relearned and retrained and it's just, it's just different.